Hello guys, Tutorial Things here and today I'm gonna show you how to draw pen a face like this. So yeah, let's go! So if you didn't see my main channel, I did a panda face with doodles. And so today, I'm gonna draw a panda face just for you guys. So yeah, let's get started. We're gonna start out with the head. The lines are not gonna be straight, they're gonna be kinda triangles and some squiggly lines. So the main thing, the lines are not straight. So when we're gonna finish the head, we're gonna start out with making the hair face. So when we do the half of the head, we're gonna start out with the hair. So again, the lines are not straight, I'm gonna tell only once. So second hair is gonna be different than the first hair and well, you will see how it looks. So when we do the ears, we're gonna start out with the bottom of the face. And again, we're gonna do the triangles. When we finish on the left side, we now start on the right side. When we are finished, we're gonna start out with making kinda marks uh, around the eyes. So we're starting right of the center, uh, kinda four or six centimeters from the top. So, uh, it's gonna be kinda shaped like a pear. On the left side, it's gonna be the same. So now we start with the eye. We're gonna start from here. To go up and down. So this is the eyebrow. So we now finish the kind of eyebrow and then we're gonna make an eye, a circle from this point to this point. So pandas don't have uh, round eyes, they have kind of squares in the, in the eyes. So we're gonna make um, details uh, in the bottom of the eyes and another one in between the eye and the detail which goes from the middle to the eye so then we're gonna start out with the second eye it will look the same but it's gonna be kind of faster version So again, we start out with the eyebrow, connect the lines, we then do the circle, and the little square in the eye. And don't forget the details on the bottom of the eye. So when we are finished with the details and the eyes, we're gonna start up with coloring ears, marks, and in the eyes. So I recommend uh, not using ink uh, to fill it. Use uh, 120 black marker, touch 5 marker. So I recommend to use a white side of the touch 5 120 black marker so it will be faster paper and start coloring the second year so 
So of course then we do the inside of the eyes but don't color the little square. It needs to be white. And finally we're gonna color the inside of the mark around the eye. But we're gonna leave details so you can see the details. When you finish on the right side, you of course go on the left side. So when we're finished with the marks, then we start we start doing kinda lines, straight lines to the middle and do kinda triangle on the middle. So when we're done with this, then we do it on the left side. So when we <laughs> when we finished with the left and the right side, we do the nose. So we go from this to down and up, and down and up. Now we're gonna do the inside of the nose. And then we are gonna draw a chin on the bottom of the mouth. So yeah, we're almost finished. Uh, now we just need to do the details and some coloring. So now we're just gonna color the nose, the mouth, and then we're gonna start up with the details. So make kind of on the bottom of the nose again lines so it will look more realistic or don't if you don't want to as you draw. So then we're gonna start with a straight kind of line on top of the nose and do some details around the nose. So feel free to get your imagination out and draw details. You don't need to copy it, you can do it all of all yourselves. So now we're gonna do lines that are going on the right and now they're going on the left. And on the top we're gonna just switch. These lines are going left and these are going right. So now we are finished, we just do the details around the face. So when you're done with the details, you can use a marker, GG3, which is a light grey color, which will do some shades, shadows, on your details. I'm done, I hope everybody enjoyed and yeah, I will see you in the next video. Bye!